Good morning class. Let's have the magnetic declination problem. So this is uh, in your notes 3. So you have this problem. In a compass survey made 50 years ago, the observed magnetic bearing of reference line AB was 50 degrees 18 minutes east when the magnetic declination was 8 degrees 15 minutes east lately in 2016 a new survey was made and the magnetic declination in the same survey site changed to 12 degrees 10 minutes west determine the following descriptions of line E, B. Letter A, you have the true bearing. Letter B, the true azimuth from north and south. Uh, south. And letter C, you have its new magnetic bearing for 2016. And then D is the magnetic azimuth from north and south in 2016. Okay, so before we can answer the problem, Let's try to draw the illustration for this problem. Okay, so let us draw. You have the reference meridian and reference par parallel or the true north and the magnetic north. Okay, first you have the true north. This is the symbol for true north and this is for true south okay and then this is for this is for east and west Okay, so we are given a reference line AB that is south uh, 50 degrees 18 minutes east. So let's draw that. That is south east. Okay. southeast and it was measured from a magnetic bearing okay so for the magnetic bearing you have a magnetic declination of 8 degrees east so from true north you have the direction of the magnetic bearing so you have this line with an angle of 8 degrees 15 minutes since your magnetic declination is going to east okay so let us draw that that is now the magnetic This is the magnetic north. Okay. 50 years ago. So magnetic no north 50 years ago. So let's have this one 50 years ago. Okay. And then you have the magnetic bearing. For the magnetic bearing, it's measured from the magnetic north to the reference line AB. This is your reference line AB.
okay so with an angle of 50 or that is south 50 degrees 18 minutes east that is the magnetic bearing with your magnetic declination this one equal to 8 degrees 15 minutes and that is also equal to this angle This is 8 degrees, 15 minutes. Okay. So that is for the reference line AB. Where the magnetic bearing is southeast. And the angle is 50 degrees, 18 minutes. And then the magnetic declination 50 years ago that is 8 degrees 15 minutes okay so in 2016 the survey was made and the magnetic declination of the same survey site was changed to 12 degrees west so this time west direction for the magnetic declination let's have another line have another line so that is west okay west Okay, so that one, this is now the magnetic north 2016. Okay, with an angle of Twelve degrees ten minutes. Okay, so that angle is equivalent to this one. Twelve degrees Twelve uh, degrees ten minutes. Okay. So we are to determine the true be true bearing of line AB. Okay. So for the true bearing. This is now the true bearing. So you start from you start from north. So this is now the true bearing of line AB. So let us answer letter A. You have the true bearing or that is beta is equal to For the true bearing that is equal to the bearing magnetic bearing 50 years ago which is 50 degrees 18 minutes minus the magnetic declination so that is the magnetic bearing minus the magnetic declination equal to 
the true B ring. Okay. So, minus 8 degrees 15 minutes. So, that is equal to, we need a calculator. Okay, so we have 50 degrees, 18 minutes minus 8 degrees, 15 minutes. So we now have an angle of 42 degrees, 3 minutes with the direction, since this is bearing south east okay so that is the answer for letter a for letter b you are to solve for the true azimuth from north and south okay so letter b letter b let's have azimuth from north and azimuth from south so for the azimuth you have from north that is true azimuth so that's from true north to this line let's have a n and then from south this one A S okay so from the illustration we can solve directly for the azimuth from north and azimuth from south for azimuth from north you have uh, 180 so 180 this is a straight line 180 degrees minus the B ring okay so let's have 180 degrees minus the B ring which is 42 degrees 3 minutes okay so you have 180 degrees minus 42 degrees 3 minutes that's equivalent to one three seven degrees fifty seven minutes okay and then for the azimuth from south you just add the uh, one eighty since you have from north that is one hundred thirty seven degrees fifty seven minutes so for from south that is just 180 degrees plus the azimuth from north okay so therefore you have 180 that is from south to north 180 and then you have the azimuth from north so plus one three seven degrees 57 minutes so 180 degrees plus one three seven degrees 57 minutes so that is three one seven degrees 57 minutes okay so this is the answer for letter A and then for letter B. Okay. Next for letter C, you are to solve for the new magnetic bearing. So for the new magnetic bearing, 
you will start from this one this line magnetic north for 2016 going to the reference line ab okay so let's extend it first extend and then this is now the new magnetic bearing magnetic bearing new okay so to solve for the new magnetic bearing this one we can have the true bearing true true bearing of line ab minus the magnetic declination during 2016 so that is equivalent to the magnetic new magnetic bearing okay so to solve for that you have new magnetic bearing is equal to the true bearing which is 42 degrees 3 minutes minus 12 degrees 10 minutes okay so calculate you have 42 degrees 3 minutes minus 12 degrees 10 minutes so that's equivalent to 29 degrees 53 minutes and that is a B ring so therefore you have the direction south east okay so that's the answer for letter C and then lastly for letter D you have the magnetic <clears throat> azimuth from north and south in 2016 so you will start from the magnetic north during 2016 magnetic north and magnetic I know yes magnetic north and magnetic south so this one let's have another color this one violet so from north you have this one new is from north so that is azimuth from north new and then this one azimuth from south new Okay, so you have letter D, azimuth from north new is equal to, you have this one going to this one. So magnetic north during 2016 going to the reference line AB, so that is 180, so this is 180 straight line minus the magnetic bearing during 2016 okay so therefore you have 180 degrees minus 29 degrees 53 minutes and then calculate you have 180 degrees minus 29 degrees 53 minutes so that is 150 degrees 7 minutes so that is for the azimuth from north for the azimuth from south new that is just the same with this one so that is 180 that is from south 
to north, 180, plus the azimuth from north to the reference line, 150 degrees, 7 minutes. So, therefore, calculate 180 degrees plus 150 degrees, 7 minutes. So, that is equivalent to 330 degrees, 7 minutes. Okay, so...